Good morning, wonderful people. And this is Jerry Travis Smith back again with an Excel quick tip. This isn't going to be a very long video, but I actually made a boo-boo last time that I was, um, after we had recorded the um, intro to Excel video one, I didn't save the file. I set it to start rendering. I walked off. And when I came back, I had had a power outage. Um, the video got uploaded and everything, but I lost the um, original Lemonade Stand file. Now, Excel did recover it, okay? And I actually had recorded a video already of saving this thing from the recovered version, but something happened with my video recorder. And um, so I'm having to do it again. So you'll see we've got book two. And usually if you see book one, book two, book three, and so on, that means the file hasn't been saved. So the quickest way to save a file is to use the keyboard shortcut Control S. And what that's going to do is just save. Okay, Control S. And I recommend that you always do Control S just every few minutes because if you have a power outage, you lose everything you got. I was writing a big term paper in college. There was this guy down the hallway that had this ginormous microwave decided he needed a burrito after I had been working on this paper four hours. When he goes to nuke the burrito, it knocked the power out of our dorm. So, always make sure to um, control S every few minutes. Now, if you don't want to control S, you can always go to File and Save. Okay, so the first time you go to save a file, it's going to pop up with Save As because we haven't told this thing where we want to save yet. So here's recent folders that I've already used, but let's assume you didn't have these here because this is the first time you've ever saved in Excel or any other Office document. I'll just double click Computer, and I've already got a folder in here called Intro to Excel because you want to make various folders for whatever it is you're wanting to do. Now let's give it a file name that's kind of descriptive. Okay, so I'm going to call it So Sweet Lemonade Stand Sales. August 2016. Pretty descriptive. And you can see the full file path where this is saving to. Okay, so there you go. We have managed to save this. Now, as I make changes, you can either go File and Save, okay, or hit Control S on the keyboard. And you'll notice how quick it saved because um, you don't have to tell it where you want it to go now. All right, it will save it there. Now, if you want to make a copy of it with a different file name, you can always use Save As and put it in a different place, or you can put it in the same folder with a different name, whatever you wanted to do. One of these days, I'll do a video with some advanced file management techniques, but for now, this is enough to get you going so that you can say, hey, I, I saved my Excel file like a good computer user. So that's it for today's quick tip. Always remember, save early, save often. Have a great day.